can still have Dory in me, you know, but as soon as I got in the studio, it was pretty easy to just get that, that voice and that character, and the writing is so good. He's so amazing, and the story is really sweet. It's emotional, it's funny, it's everything you want from the film. So I'm, I'm just uh, thrilled. Look at here, guys, guys. Thank you, ladies. I think she's, uh, she's innocent, and I think that she's optimistic, and I think that she's um, non-judgmental, and I think especially in the world right now, we need that, and people hope to have that inside of themselves, and they look at that and say, if that's not who I am, that's who I want to be. So we're a bit late to the party, but I, can't, I mean, I can't wait. Everyone's so excited about it. And, and what's interesting is that my so my nieces and nephews are in their 20s, are as excited about it as my kids who are sort of, you know, six and seven and eight. And, and uh, it's, it's, it's such a great company and a great film. I have to find my family. Well, that's a hard one, kid. Well, I guess you're stuck here. You're not helping, Bill. Grab the things. I lost my family. That is so sad. You weren't the... Not a great swimmer. Our friend is in there, lost, alone. Bailey, you've got to use your echolocation. Ooh, ooh I feel stupid. Poor baby. Let me get that for you. Woo! She should just pick two and let's go. Dad. What? I'm kidding. I get the feeling they're shushing us for a reason. Like something with one big eye, tentacles, and a snappy thing? Well, that's very specific, but something like that. 